and that uh -huh. people constantly call uh -huh. it. Ah, I hope they don't call you for electric truck problem. No, 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 never, no. We are today in Tampere, Finland, and I am with Lassi. My name is Lassi Lahti and I work in ED Logistica Oil. We distribute for a lot of companies, uh, all kinds of coach. I work as transport coordinator and I take care of drivers, I take care of trucks and the everyday things. Okay. Make sure everything is going fine. You are operating electric trucks from now quite a few uh, years? For several years, yeah. yeah, yeah. Uh, what was your reaction first? I was feeling really skeptical, really, because something that's not been properly tested came for us to test. And now, so after several years? I'm quite impressed. This really surprised me. It's, it hasn't even lost any range during the winter time. It really works. Uh, you have two trucks? Yeah. I heard that you will receive three more? Yeah. We are going to take the next step. We'll be driving between terminals and there will be a lot more kilometers. So you will do uh, more than 600 or yeah. 700 kilometers? Yeah, something like that. Do they uh, appreciate to have uh, their deliveries made with electric trucks? Or yes. Is it because of the uh, environmental impact? Yes, it's, it's because of that. And uh, also, when done right, it can really be more affordable. I think you are one of the pioneers. If you had an advice, what would you say to your, the rest of the industry? Just do it. <laughs>